Look at that heart. Hey everybody, it's BuildTX. Welcome back to a new Let's Play. Welcome back. Welcome to a new Let's Play. Kirby 64, The Crystal Shards. Not actually the original second Let's Play I wanted to do, but I'll get into that a bit later. So, why am I doing a new Let's Play here? Here. And what happened to my WarioWare bonus video? To that I say, <laughs> it will not arrive for a very, very long time. Because as in my WarioWare bonus video, I want to show off everything in the game. And there's a lot I do to unlock everything. So it'll be a very long time until that comes out. It's out so don't hold your breath. Also, looking back on the videos I've been doing, I've... Oh god, this is going to be embarrassing, but... I'll get to the I'll get to the save file in a second, but looking back on the videos I've as I've been doing, I realize I've as I'm kind of running out of ideas and scripts and scripts and doing a lot of research takes a very long time, so I figured I'd give myself a little break by starting up a new let's play. Now this save file, save file number two, is the second save file number two. If that sounds confusing, basically it's I've had two failed recordings. The first failed recording, I completely forgot to do something, and the second one, I really didn't like how it came out, so... Here's hoping this will go well. So, but, with that said, let's delete this. Thankfully, the second time around, it didn't actually do much, so I don't feel bad about doing this. BOOM! Exploded! <sighs> this, this hurts. This hurts bad. <sighs> let's just start this up. Yes, we know how to use Kirby's, a cop Kirby's copy ability. I'm going to go over that in at, at my own detail. However, the good news is I actually know a few more about this game. I actually know a little more about this game from my failed recordings. Because I am actually doing this semi-blind. Uh, that first save file there is my... That first save file is my personal one. And then as you can see, I've, got, I've done about 40% of the game. Maybe that will change in the future. I don't know. Oh, oh, chances are I might complete this game aim before I'm finished with the Let's Play, so... Oh, but at least for now, it's semi-blind, so I don't know everything. But let's just sit back and enjoy this. Cutscene which just ended! Level 1! Sorry about that noise. Level 1, Pop Star! So this dice, yes, it may look like a Jap... Oh my god, I just bow it is. It's not a Japanese flag, it's a dice. I can't believe I just said that. Very minor detail, but I still want to bring attention to it, because that's what I thought it was at first. So, you see those, little, those three little diamonds there? We will be seeing what those are as we get into this. With that said, let's start up level one. God, that background looks really bad. So, this is it. The world of the N64. Or, so, so the controls, like I said, I will go over them myself. I'll, I'll, I'll press B to inhale, press down to swallow. Unfortunately, that thing did nothing. Wow, that was bad. Okay, if you press B, holding an enemy. Yes, you can swallow it, but you can also release it. But in terms of that enemy, that's not what I want to do. This enemy will also give us something, something special if we swallow it. You see that little icon down there? That is this! Needle Kirby, personally my favorite ability that I have seen in the game so far. And I will do my best as to cut. I will do my best to cover every single ability in the game. Do I think I'll be able to do it? Probably not. But, let's hope we can. So with that said, I'm gonna swallow that and release it because we don't need it. This thing. Fireball Kirby. This block? We if we press our head against it, we can go full-on Mario and get an item. Very, very cool. So, Fireball Kirby. Kirby, you press B, and he will unleash as a Fireball. Like Mario. More Mario stuff. Okay. But, I'm gonna release that. At Jump up and inhale this guy. Jump up and inhale this guy. Swallow. I pressed the wrong button. Uh, it's fine. We'll see him. Ah, uh, we'll see him again. There he is. Alright. This guy. We hold B. Swallow. We will get this. Cutter Kirby. And look at that. He throws his own head. Actually pretty creepy looking. This thing. This is what that diamond thing was. A shard. We get that crystal shard. Uh, it didn't seem to do anything. but it, it, it didn't really seem to do anything. But trust me, it does. You see that yellow bar? If you... Er, 
You see that yellow bar? Normally, normally, getting a star will increase it. Getting a shroud, however, will also increase it rapidly. This thing is this thing is a maximum tomato staple in the Kirby series. Uh, I just burped right there. Wonderful. But uh, airful. So if you're low on health, this will revive all your health bar, no matter how low you are. But we don't really need it, so just for yeah, you know, I'll collect it just because I want to. But we really don't need it. But we enter this cabin here. We have a mini boss. And probably the most pathetic, pathetic mini-bosses of all time. It doesn't even attack you. It's minions that... I like how I take damage, just as I'm complaining how easy it is. Wonderful. Okay. But, but what I want to do is get rid of this. This, because we are going to, because we're going to need a different ability. If we, if we are to move on. So I'm going to heal this guy. It, and, okay, I'll inhale this guy and hit him into this. That That is one way you can kill enemies in this game. It's very cool because this game has a large variety of ways to do things. This, if we inhale this block, it'll release the canyon and we can collect like, this star that was inside of it. This food, as you might expect, as you might expect, will regain your health. We don't really need it, but I'm going to collect it. Uh, but, actually, what? Now, I'll collect that one, but I'm not going to collect this one just in case I take damage. Another... Another way, another way that you can defeat enemies is by doing this. Fly up and release, press B and you will release a puff of air that will destroy them. Yes, these enemies die from air. Talk about weak. Their evolution has not been good to them, but oh well. So what we want is this, Bomb Kirby. To do that, we uh, we can we, we, we just inhale that Poppy Bros Jr. there. We throw bombs at that iron thing and it will, re and it will reveal a shard below it. Something, something, something I discovered completely by a something I discovered completely by accident in my first failed recording. So you know what? In a way, my my failed recordings have been good to me because it allowed me to do this maximum tomato that went that almost went completely a waste. Bomb duel. So we enter this patch of grass right here. Look at that waddle Oh. Well, these are actually pretty cute. Well, these are pretty cute. I like the way they look. But we have this black thing right on here. And I'm not sure if this is just coincidence, but you see that black thing has one eye? Well, guess what? There's another Cyclops in this Kirby. Kirby, Kish. Kirby is a universe. Waddle Doos. So, is this the origin of how Waddle Doos are created? I don't know. So we, so we have two ways of defeating him. We could throw these bombs at him and be extremely cheap, or we can get rid of the bombs and do this the legitimate way, the legitimate way which is what I will do. To do that, uh, 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 he, will sl he will slam his body on the ground, uh, 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 on the ground to release those stars, and you have to inhale them. However, if you touch a star, it will hurt you. So be, so be careful about that. But I know what to do, so I'm just gonna let him, uh, so I'm just gonna let him hurt him, hurt himself. Health, inhale a star, and hit it back at him. Kirby, right back at ya. That's what we do best at NME. Also, have I not introduced her? That's Ribbon. How have I not introduced who that was yet? But yes, that is Ribbon. Uh, I'm sure we'll learn more about her in the future, but in the meantime, there, that's name. Well, you have your name. And with that, Waddle D is joining our adventure. Look at this, we have a picnic. Can I get a one up? I can! You know how you don't know how many times I feel like getting that one up. It seems pretty easy, but now it's actually a lot harder than it looks. So with that, that is level one. We have completed all those. And again, about that being a Japanese flag, no, it is a dice, and that brings us here. With that, we can move on to level two. Which we will do. To do. Do do. I'm gonna stop now. That bird, that bird, that bird enemy will, it will, it will come out of the ground, try to attack you, attack you, but it will not give you an item. Enemies, enemies, you, you stand below those log, you try to, you try to inhale them from here, they'll struggle for a bit and then be destroyed. So that's another way you can destroy them. It's actually really cool just how many ways you can destroy enemies. This thing. Uh, no, that's not what I wanted. Ugh. Or that will happen. Um, here we go. Rock Kirby. We will turn into a rock. And guess what? 
We are, we are pretty much invincible from just about anything. However, as you can see, we walk incredibly slow. So, so if you want to sacrifice speed for defense, I, I, I and uh, speed for defense, I'd accept it, but I don't want to do that. So I'm gonna get rid of that and get uh, and get this maximum tomato. And one more thing, you cannot fly in that form, which is a, as a matter of fact, I will re act. I can show that off right now. Look at this. We go B. Yeah, we cannot. We cannot fly when doing this. If we don't press B, we can fly, but th but this power up has a lot of downs. As a, but this power up has a lot of downsides. Uh, outsides. Um, if we hold B, if we hold B and move at the same time, we will roll a bit. Okay. Did that? Wait. Did that? Okay. Now we didn't take damage, so I guess it didn't hurt us. But yes, there are a number of mechanics you can do. But I'm going to get rid of that and inhale this enemy. What will that give us? Plasma Kirby or Spark Kirby? I really don't know. I really can't. You don't know which one is which. But with that, we enter here. Uh, you don't know how much it breaks my heart to miss out on Needle Kirby. Okay, these spider enemies. Look at this. I am standing right below them, and they cannot hurt us. Remember that. As long as you are standing on the ground, they will not hurt you. But with that, we have this enemy, Chili. I know, very, I know, very clever. Anyway, this enemy, Chili, will get us Ice Kirby, a grossly overpowered ability. Look at this. There is so much, it's, this, it really is grossly overpowered. Look at this. We can even freeze Chili. Yeah, we can freeze a snowman with ice. We can stop uh, up the Poppy Bros. Jr.'s bombs. It's gross. Oh, This part. I don't like this. It's fu- it, Okay. I want, okay, I want to say I don't like it, but I do find it annoying. So we have the swing that the Waddle Dee is controlling. Pretty simple, right? Yeah, we got a, free, a bunch of free starts to click. That's not all, though. Something I want, something I want to bring up. Kirby's flight time is limited, and I want to collect that shard. I was lucky enough to survive there. However, if you er, if you collect that shard, er, be careful, because again, his uh, and as uh, and I'm going to dem I'm going to demonstrate this now. Unlike in the other games, his flight is not unlimited. He will get tired eventually. And if you do that off the cliff, you are screwed. And even if he starts to get tired and I let go of A. Okay, that was a bad example. But, okay, let's try this again. I, sw I fly up, release A. I'll let him float down. I'll let him float down a bit. No, it does not work. He will still get tired. Hired. So that does not work. This part, okay, this part, this part has fooled me twice, and I'm not going to let it do it again. First of all, I'm going to grab this king just because I want to. Watch carefully. Go to the side. Look at this. You will get a maximum tomato and a one-up twice now. I have been fooled by that, but not this time. Look at that. I already have four one-ups, which is insane. Okay, well, okay. Okay, not really. Let's just defeat this thing. Look at this! Even this thing is very, very easy to def- Even this thing is very, very easy to defeat. But I'm gonna stop now because I do want to do- Because I do want to show defeating legitimately, so here you go. Yeah! It- Yeah! When they fall, it's not particularly- It's not particularly easy to do. Uh, maybe I should stop jumping. And turn around! Timing! It's all about timing, but clearly I do not have it. Nope. Hit her! Hit her! Thank you! Oh, we did the. Okay, crystal shard. Crystal shard. I got another crystal shard. There we go. This guy. He may look familiar. I will introduce him after this boss battle. Did I just spoil it with a boss battle for you? Probably not. Either way, he has a shard, and again, that weird black thing comes out. I'll be quiet until this is over. <laughs> I wanted to be quiet, but Kirby's face there when he gets hit always gets me. Ugh. This guy is Adeline. I know. 
I keep breaking my own rules. Very, very easy boss fight. All we have to do is inhale these enemies, these throw them, and we don't even have to do that. If we inhale them, wait for the next one to pop out. Look at that. Two, uh, two in one shot. And, but just for the sake of it, I won't be doing that li at this time. And I'm just going to hold him in. Oh! Oh, no! No, it's not done yet! There's still a second phase! There's another drawing we have to fight! No! But that's... But... Okay, that's... But that is the reason I held on to the enemy. I hold on to him, release him, we can get a pretty free... We can get a free shot in. Very, very nice. Please turn around. But the way we do this legitimately is he, is he throws that ice, and look at that. So we just wait, wait for him to throw more ice, man. Suck it up and hit him with it. Look at this, he's angry again. Phase three of the fight. Uh, a drawing of that thing. What is it? We'll find out eventually. This part is actually not too easy. Specifically the part about hitting him is not too easy. Okay, I know I'm making it look easy, but you won't believe how many times I failed at this. Wait for that, and we hit him. Uh, and this part has gotten me. And this part has gotten me. Tw has gotten me three times now. As you can see, he's waiting. He, he is running frantically. You might be thinking, "All right, what's he gonna do? He's gonna release something." No, he will never release anything. Instead, we have to do. Is charge up, run into him. That, I mean, yeah, you have to take damage in order to defeat him. Which I personally find is very cheap. I don't like, that is one of the things I will complain about. I don't like that one bit. Especially because of how many times this got in me. In fact, the first time, I just remembered this. The first time I was actually completely by accident. Accident. I meant to stop run, up running and I just happened to go into him, but... So, you know what? Freak accident saved lives. <laughs> that is not how I meant to word that. Can we get a one-up this time? We can! Oh my god, why am I getting so many one-ups this time around? So, we've gotten all shards. Very, very good. So, we will be saving level 3 for next time. Next time! I... Kirby 64, the Crystal Shards. I kept almost saying Kirby's Adventure. Next time, level three. Can we do it? Yes, we can. I was not trying to reference anything there. But, next time, level three. What is on this pencil? It's like a Luma that says, it's like, it looks like a Luma that says Popeye. That'd be a good way to get kids to eat their spinach. I know I certainly don't.